Hey guys, Nick here, and I've got a few simple tips to help make your videos look a bit better. Um, I do use these in most of my videos, and a lot of people have commented that uh, that my videos look quite good, so I thought I'd share these with you. So first off, I'm just going to show you what this Modern Warfare 2 clip looks like with no effects, no color correction, nothing like that. Um, just going to play this real quick so you can see what it looks like. And uh, that pretty much is how it would look on a monitor um, without any effects or anything. So that's how it would look as you're playing it, but people like to add things to make it look a little different. So we're going to add three things here. Um, let me just show that again. If you go over here, you click track effects, and uh, you want to add Sony color corrector, Sony saturation adjust, and Sony sharpen. Just click add and then click OK. Um, so we'll start off with color correction here, and I have these settings already saved, but you're going to see what these are. Um, so you can see all the all the settings here. Um, found these on a f I found all of these settings on a forum a while back, and uh, I don't really remember where they were, but thank you to whoever posted them. So we're just going to take a look here. That is with the color correction. If I turn it off for a second, you can see things become a little bit more dull and just kind of makes everything look a little bit brighter, a little less foggy and dull. Um, so now we'll play that again with the color correction added. So it, it's a slight difference, nothing huge, but it's definitely noticeable. Um, next we have our saturation adjust. This makes a bit of a bigger difference than the color correction. Now what saturation adjust does is it generally saturates things, makes them brighter. So this is the setting that I use here. You can see all these numbers. And um, you may have noticed that things, colors popped out. If you look at the C flag and the A flag and that Claymore. Now watch as I turn it off. They kind of become dull. It pretty much just exaggerates all the colors in everything. Um, you see the minimap becomes more green. Um, sometimes this kind of backfires and makes things really orange, but I still think it looks kind of cool to have the, the saturation adjust on there. And uh, now sharpen. Um, if I go over here to sharpen, this just kind of makes things a little sharper. And I'm not quite sure how it does it, but um, under certain circumstances it makes things a bit sharper. You might have to play this in 1080p to notice the difference, but if you look down here at the experience bars, um, when I turn it back on, you can kind of see the edges of them a little bit more. And, uh, yeah, it just makes things a little less blurry. Um, so now I'll play this clip again with all three of the effects that I use. And you can probably tell it looks a lot better. Uh, maybe not the way it's supposed to look, but it does look a lot better. So I'm just going to show you another example here. I have a um, terminal gameplay, which is a very colorful map and uh, I'm going to show you each of the effects one at a time. So sharpen makes a slight difference, not really noticeable um, in most cases. Saturation adjust, uh, a bit of a bigger difference there. And the color correction, and now with all three of them, that is what it looks like with all three. And if I bypass all of the effects and use none of them, it looks like that and it kind of looks gray and dull when you turn them off but uh, when you turn them all back on it looks a lot brighter so hopefully this helped um, please like the video if you enjoyed and if it was helpful subscribe if you want to see some more of my videos and uh, thanks for watching guys I'll see you later bye